There we go, beautiful. Oh, slow up. Oh, whoa. Oh, did I just shoot his young wangs? That is funny. Oh, this guy just gave up. Let's back it up a little bit. Oh my god, just two shots. <laughs> two shots and he was gone. Hey guys, Jibrag here. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Cross Out. In today's video, I have another best creation episode for you guys. But before we start, I haven't officially announced that I have a new logo and I kind of updated my channel a little bit. Kind of, yeah, kind of gave it a, a nice, fresh new look. I have a new logo. Hope you guys like it. I made a post about it. Um, a lot of people thought it was like a uh, Halo Marine guy, but it was kind of inspired by the Doom Marine. But the the guy who designed it for me, I wanted a post-apocalyptic type of character. You know, a kind of a beat up Doom Marine guy with a helmet. But he just gave me that and I kind of liked it, so I stuck with it. I'm also trying to get it in the game so you guys can, uh, you know, put it on a stick as a sticker on your car and stuff like that. But yeah, that's the first thing. And the second thing, I added a uh, membership to the channel so you guys can join and support me a little bit more directly. And everything you do support me with will go directly into the channel so I can keep making awesome content for you guys. Now, with that out of the way, Let's start with the video. So we got a best creation for you guys. We have four different builds, kind of cool builds, if you ask me. Um, this is not the first one, but this one is interesting. Some people asked me in the comment section, what if I use two pulsers, a photon cabin and a Aurora to get extra photon or pulsar damage? But that's not all. We also have four claws in the bag. This build makes no sense. Like, if someone wedges me in the bag, I am completely toast because there's a huge ammo box here. But we are still going to run with it because we are... I mean, I guess we can put something here to protect us a little bit. Like, to have, like, an inverted wheel. Let's see if we can add a inverted... Not an inverted wheel, but an, another bigram just to, like... Yeah, no, it's uh, the biograms take up so much spot uh, space, but let, let's just leave it like that. Uh, this is the first build. Let me show you guys what it's made of because it has a bunch of stuff. Like I mentioned, Apollo Gen, two pulsars, four hovers, one Aurora, one ammo box, hot red engine, some fuel in the front to smash into the enemy's photon cabin, four bigram legs, the rest are structural parts. We, wow, durability wise, it's not that great. Only 1440 durability but we're gonna make it work the second build we got is a quasar build with the quantum cabin and four claw wheels i think with the perk active with the the claw perk and the photon ca uh, quantum cabins perk i think the pulsars can deal a decent amount of damage 324 not that bad but we are at 8k so let's see if we can get one of these bots and uh, see what kind of damage ah not that great but i think we can make it work yeah it's not that bad so this is the second build kind of looks cool the third build we got is a complete lunatic build except for the wheels and the cheetah engine everything else on this build is from the lunatic so i thought it looked pretty cool it's like a nice lunatic boss vehicle with two hammerfall shotguns i miss the hammerfalls man but i heard it sucks so I didn't really go for it anymore. Let's quickly check what this one's made of. This one has two hammer falls, a Camille Mark II, two RNC radiators, a Doppler radar, cheetah engine, four Bigfoot wheels, and the bootstrap generator. And we're using the aggressor cabin. A uh, decent amount of durability and the rest are structural parts, so not a lot. Let's quickly go over the uh, hover build as well. All right, so this build has a quantum cabin, four claw wheels, two quasars, a hazardous generator, a Dunhorst engine, whoever who even uses that anymore. Uh, we're carrying some fuel tanks so we can farm some fuel. The rest is structural part, and we got a pretty decent amount of durability. All right, and the last build is this big typhoon build. It's just like a meta clan horse build. It's at 19,000 power score. So we're going to check this one out. I haven't used these um, non rotating turret cannons in a long time. I just want to feel how they are then you know these days so this one has two typhoons a oppressor engine chameleon mark ii a expanded ammo box a um 
Apollo generator, the icebox cabin, a reload module, okay, two flywheel, and a bunch of hovers, like two, five, nine, ten hovers, damn. Durability-wise, it's not a lot, but I think we'll be fine. Now, you guys just sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. All right, guys, welcome to Nameless Tower. I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't think we're gonna use this cabin spur too much, because we're a shotgun build, we're gonna have to drive around and make a lot of turns like this. Okay, let's fall back. Someone was trying to heat up my guns. Let's go for Octagon over here. Is that a... F oh, it's a Hulk. Oh, and he has a... Ooh, poor guy. The hammer falls don't feel that bad, man. They might not be the strongest shotguns, but I really want a pair of hammer falls, man. There we go, beautiful. Let's look up. Oh, whoa! Oh, did I just shoot his young wangs? That is funny. Oh, this guy just gave up. Let's back it up a little bit. Oh my god, just two shots! <laughs> two shots and he was gone. He didn't even bother shooting me. Oh man, yeah, hammer falls are still good, man. I think shotguns in general are just so powerful in this game. It's crazy. Nice. All right, guys, we are on the bridge. Uh, whoa, everybody's like, oh wait, we got someone over here. I'm not sure if it's a bot. I don't think. I think it is because bots usually charge up. Nice, six oh six. Ah, damn it. That's what I hate about pulsars. They're so slow. I mean, quasars. And these aren't fuse or anything. This, these are just stock quasars. What? The heck? I, I hate that you can't shoot through trees. So annoying. There we go. That guy is gone. Oh, poor guy. Thought he was going to be okay. Apparently not. Okay. He still has his parsers. So, we got to watch out. Oh, he just shot. Let's quickly do a drive-by. There we go. <laughs> Let's do another drive-by-ish thingy. There we go. It worked. Do one more since our perk is active for our wheels. Oh, too late. Boom. Nice. All right. Uh, a few players left. Two players and two bot. Oh, Matthew over here. Oh, gotta watch out. Gotta watch out. Gotta watch out. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's get this guy real quick. Oh, that was a miss. Oh, major slaughter. No. Out up. Ah, I'm done for. Go up on this bot here. Ah, oh, that was rough. All right, guys. Welcome to the Nameless Tower. Let's see what this thing can do. Because I'm actually kind of curious. Because I fused my pulsars. And they were great for... A oh, oh, no, no, no. They were great for a Oh my god, ew. Why is why is reverse mode in it? Oh, because I have so many different wheels. I have hovers. Oh my god. It just messes up my controls. Ew. Let's uh let's quickly disable that. Uh interface. Where what's it? Reverse. Where is it guys? Where is it? Reverse mode. Yeah, let's disable that for now. And then uh Hopefully we can come wait, wait, wait. Yeah, there we go. Ooh! Wow, I was in the menus and everything and I got him. All right, feels a little bit better now. But now my probably my spider controls are going to be messed up. Zong, you look pretty beat up there, man. Let's push up. Ooh, get this guy. Interesting combo, not gonna lie. Very interesting combo. Aurora, Pulsars, Claw Cabin, I mean <laughs> Claw Cabin, Claw Wheels, and Photon Cabin. That is a lot. That's everything working together just to give energy weapons a higher damage. <laughs> I missed though. 
Beautiful. Oh, got MVP. Nice. And I'm carrying fuel barrels. <laughs> Interesting. I like this build. All right, guys, welcome to the Ravager's Foothold. Unfortunately, we can only find matches at this bar score on the EU server, which means our ping is super high, but we're going to try our best. And also, I suck with these builds. Just uh, a little disclaimer so you guys don't attack me in the comment section. Okay, I should have shot Frank, but I'm just waiting to line up my shot. All right. Wow, that's really disappointing. Can we reload and shoot? Yes, we could, but I wasn't lined up perfectly. Oh, what? okay, I'll take it. It wasn't the guy I'm aiming for, but uh, that works out. Come on, come on. There you go, beautiful. It, it, I'm, I'm a bit slow, all right, guys? I'm a bit slow. Oh, God. Madison, what on earth? Oh, oh God damn, I got decloaked immediately. Yeah, I personally don't like cannon builds like this with a bunch of armor in the front just blocking my... Oh, my God. What? Oh my god. Like, these builds, the build that I'm using, these type of builds kick ass in Clan Wars, but you gotta know how to use them, because if not, you're gonna be struggling like me. And this world build is extremely effective, surprisingly. I know this build. I've been running into it a lot. Okay, I'm gonna run a little bit. As soon as this guy stops shooting me. There we go. Ah, oh, god dang it. Uh. Oh. Oh, man. There you go, guys. Fortune's on hovers. Worked really well. All right, guys. Welcome to Old Town. Um, A bit laggy. Our ping is even worse now. So, oh, my God. Really? Really? Come on, man. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to do too well with this build, guys. I, I don't do well with cannon builds with high ping. It's just, it's just really hard to use. Uh, so I'm going to stick with my team here and see what we can do. Oh, sorry, man. Like, the, the latency makes everything feel extra sluggish. Oh, God, it wasn't my intention. Three hundred. 400 damage, not the best. If this guy moves a little bit, I can squeeze in a shot. There we go. They're just gawk fighting right now. They both have machine gun builds <laughs> on spiders. Okay, yeah, not not the best experience. Also, this build's way too big for Old Town. Oh my god. Like, everybody's in one spot. What the hell's going on? Okay. And I'm still staying here, even though everybody should not be in this spot. Th and this is what I don't like about these cannons, too. Like, some shots are really underwhelming. Okay, that shot was a complete miss. There we go, that one was good. That was a miss. Very sluggish. Dude, why you do this to me? Oh my god, really? Oh my god. Yeah, I'm not I'm not gonna do this again. Wow, I did horrible, but I still got first on my team. Props to whoever plays these builds in Clan Wars Band. I, I can do it. That's why I usually never play these in PvP for the for videos. I just can't play them. Well, guys, there you have it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully that match with the Typhoons wasn't too rough for you guys to watch. It was rough for me to play. And, but this one was pretty interesting, though. Um, I think this one was the most interesting. But I'll leave this one and the this one. I'll leave how it's built in the end of the video so you guys uh, can see that, whoever's interested. Um, personally, uh, this one wasn't that great. It's a great-looking build. It's fun, but... I won't run it as a daily PvP build. And this one's just the whole mess. Like, you can take a screenshot and see how it's built here. Because eh, 19k is a bit rough. 
Uh, but anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to the channel and leave a comment because that helps out with the algorithm. Also, you can also join now as a member. Don't forget about that. If you guys want to support me uh, a little bit more directly. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys have a great day. Peace out. <laughs>